Welcome back to part 14 of the Dark Cloud 2 walkthrough. So this is just kind of a quick guide on how to actually play Speeda. So, all you need to do is clear out all the enemies in a floor, and then you're able to play Speeda. There's a few nuances in some of the maps, like in this floor right here, for example, I can knock this ball out of the map to get it into a portion that is in the map. Although, if you mess up like that, you're risking it. I got lucky there, so everything's okay. Basically, this is just a golf mini game. You just kind of need to hit hit it. You just do your best to not knock things into the water or out of bounds or anything like that. You kind of just have to play around with this and get used to how far something will go. When you hit it. Okay. So this is like literally right next to the thing. So it's blue on blue. This won't this won't work. So the only thing I can do is bounce it off of the side and hope that it goes in. So I lined it up properly so it should go in. Boom. Just like that. Now, not every level will be as easy as that. Some of them are super easy, but some of them can be really challenging. Once you do this, you'll get access to whatever's in the chest. Gun repair powder, that's not spectacular, but sometimes you can get a diamond or a level up powder. You can get a lot of cool things from doing it. So you have to do this on every floor to get the metal. Even if you don't want to, or even if you're not going for the platinum, it's still worth doing this because you can get really good rewards from it, like a diamond, as we said. So that's all it is for this guide. So hopefully it helped. I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope you have a good day, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.